Hey, Reds. Five minute fire. Being complete, feeling complete on your own. So I've been thinking about how we are all always alone. Always have been. We are and we always will be. We came into this world alone. We will leave alone. And um, that's like a scary thought for many. For me, like... I feel incomplete because my person is not here. You feel like you're missing someone or something. But the more we can um, tap into a sense of feeling complete on our own, the easier I think it will be to let people come in and out. Because we already can always give ourselves everything that we need. And from like a physical, sexual perspective, I understand that there are things that you feel like someone else could do for you that you can't do for yourself. And that's absolutely fair enough. And there is um, a very normal, natural need for physical touch. So absolutely. Um, however, when we don't have that, that or those opportunities, it's very important that we find um, a sense of self that is complete, that keeps us grounded and content in a way that we don't suffer and struggle through this life beyond our loss and knowing how to take care of yourself is going to make it easier to allow new people to come into your life and and bring something new to your life but if they go it's going to be okay we want to be complete on our own as we are we already are it's like we are but we need to learn how to like truly know that <sighs> being alone makes a lot of us feel lonely and that's a very real feeling and there are things that we can do to help ourselves and get through the day and and then it's also really nice to have someone that makes you feel good and so that's obviously like what widow's fire i think is about for a lot of us is like wanting that external uh, relief we want, we want someone else there as well with us to have experiences with. So that's absolutely fair enough. And I just would encourage you to really think about what you can do for yourself when you can. So, um, it's so easy and natural and normal to want like I really really wanted someone to tell me I wanted a man to tell me I'm sexy I felt like oh my god I just like want that and not too long ago after a very long time waiting a very long time this great guy told me I'm really sexy And that, that's great. Like, I was like, oh my God, thank God, yes. Thank you. <laughs> I needed to hear that. I so, so badly wanted to hear that. But very soon after, like that hit, that thing you want, like it, it kind of, you know, then you need it again. You want it again and again and again. And uh, I realized that it's great you know, we all want a bit of that validation, sure. But it did hit me that um, I should just know that. I should just know that about myself and just tell myself that. Like, I totally recommend that whatever it is you think you need someone else to tell you or any praise you need, words of affirmation, like, we got to learn how to give it to ourselves. Like, I should be telling myself I'm sexy 
every day. And you should too. You're super sexy.